Okay, at this station, you're going to learn how to use a seam ripper. A seam ripper is a tool that looks like this, and it's designed to rip out stitches when you make a mistake. Uh, sometimes it's called an unpicker, um, but the more common term is seam ripper or stitch ripper. So your fabric sample that you're going to be working with has two rows of stitching. So you're going to try two different methods for pulling out stitches and then compare them. The first one, you are going to try and open up the lock stitch or the back stitching at the beginning. So you're just going to slide the the longer sharp part underneath the stitches and open it up so you can see inside and then you're going to turn it upside down so that the part with the ball is in the stitches and you're going to start pulling them out and ripping them open. So when you do that You'll notice the stitches out come out quite nicely. Um, however, there's always the danger of ripping your fabric with this part because it will actually cut through your fabric. So you do run the risk of putting a hole in it. The other method, again, you're going to begin by pulling out your lock stitches. the end and then you're just going to cut or pull out uh, about every three to four stitches so you see I'm just cutting it there um, on this fabric because it's a lightweight cotton I could probably go even further apart than this but what this does because I'm cre I'm cutting one side one of the the threads it frees up the other side. So on this side, of course I've cut my fingernails, it allows me to just pull out the thread. And those are the two different methods of seam ripping. So if you could try this on your very own sample, you don't have to go all the way across, uh, and put this into your sewing journal.